YouTube channel. Before I even start this video, I want you guys to know this is the third video that I filmed tonight. I filmed two whole videos, but I've decided in the middle of them that I don't like them. So now I'm going to this third one that I'm hoping I'm going to like. So if I like it, obviously you're seeing it right now. Anyway, so today I thought it would be really fun to give you guys a side ponytail tutorial. I've done these tutorials before. I've done like that one right there and that one right there, but I have not done one too recent and I found lots of new products that I love to use and now I like to put little colored hairs in it. So I got lots of new things to show you guys. So without any further ado, be sure to press that red subscribe button. Join my family. All right, kiddos, but now I want to get straight into this. I don't want to waste any more of you guys' time. I don't want to waste any more of my time. Let's just do a side ponytail tutorial. So first things first, these are literally the only three products. I dropped one. These are literally the only three products that I use. It's two hair brushes, one for slicking my hair, one for getting all the knots out of my hair. And this is just some hairspray. I just started using this one. It's Aussie. I used it literally for like less than a week now. But I'm obsessed with it because it smells really good. So I would recommend all these. These are wet brushes. This is Aussie hairspray. Now is the moment that you've all been waiting for. You ready? Yeah, I know. It's always a shock to everyone when I take my bow out. But honestly, like, it's so weird because I think my head looks so different. Ready? Like, no bow, bow. No bow, bow. No bow, bow. I don't know. I think my head looks different. I think it looks better with a bow. Now I gotta take my little hair clippy doos out. There's one of them. Set that down there. All right, unclip that. Call it good. Now I'm gonna rip this ponytail out. Wow! So at night, this is actually something that I always do, and currently it's night. It's like 10 o'clock. I'm in Mexico right now, but I brush out all my hairs because I use a lot of hairspray, and so I have to brush it all out before I go to bed so I can let my hair rest for a minute. Oh my gosh, Joe just threw up with her hair down. What's this? This is so weird. Sorry, I had to do it. All right, next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to flip over my hair and I'm going to brush it all out. Brush it to brush. Let's go. Let's brush it all to the side. After you got all your hair over to the side, you want to have two ponytails on standby. I like to keep them both on my wrist so then they're ready to go kind of like that. So I can go like that, pull them over, but not just yet. Now that I got all my hair up and I got my ponytails, it's time to take my hairspray and spray it all around. Hey there, Teenage Baltimore. Don't change that channel because it's time for the Corny Collins Show. Brought to you by Ultra Clutch Hairspray. Ultra Clutch Hairspray, but I definitely just had to go with it. So now, if you can't tell what I'm doing already, I'm brushing up all my hairs. I'm gonna feel it with my hands. I'm gonna make sure that it's all smooth. This is where it gets fun. I'm gonna take my ponytails and just wrap them around. I do about three times or four times, depending on the ponytails. These are actually new ponytails, so I don't need to do it four times. I only gotta do it three times. Something about me is I like my hair to be super tight, so instead of like pulling it tight, I actually just put three ponytails in it. Now, you don't have to do this to get a classic Georgia side ponytail, but if you wanna spruce it up, just go find some fake hair. I use these little clip-ins are really cute. These ones actually have colored hair and then they also have tinsel on them. And I'm just going to like kind of split my hair, not really in half, a little bit less than half, flop it over. So I'm going to take this little clippy and I'm going to clip it in the front so then you can see it when my hair is like over it. So then it's not in the back, see? So it's like right there. So then watch when I put this hair back over it, you can still kind of see it right there. Now I'm going to do the same thing with the other one except for I'm not going to pull as much hair. I'm going to pull a super, super, super thin layer. You can go right there. Awesome. The last thing before I'm going to put my bow is I'm going to just make sure all my wispies are sprayed down. I like my hair to be tight. I like to use lots of ponytails. I like to have no bumps and I like to have no wispies. Final step, you're going to take your Jojo bow and ba -choom, pop it in. And get us, that is it. That is the side ponytail tutorial. Now I'm going to wrap this video up. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. Be sure if you are new here to subscribe. If you like the classic Jojo hair to have a side ponytail and bow, give this video a thumbs up so that I know. And anyways, now get us, that's a wrap on today. I love you all so much. Peace out. Bye. My high, 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 high.